Okay, so here's the expression here. Uh, looks a bit intimidating, so what I'm going to do is rearrange it so that we get similar terms together. So here's 5a cubed and 5a squared together, and here's 4a plus 4. So I'm going to take a common factor out of these two first terms here, which is 5a squared. So 5a squared taken out of here leaves an a, and 5a squared taken out of here leaves 1 behind. And likewise with this, these two terms here, I've taken 4 out. So 4 out the front leaves an a behind and a 1. So you'll notice this expression here has a plus 1 and a plus 1. So a plus 1 is sort of our common factor. So we're going to take that common factor out the front. So you have a plus 1 out the front, and then that leaves behind 5a squared plus 4. Um, my instincts are to rearrange these two brackets, and that's what I've done in the last step, to 5a squared plus 4 and a plus 1. That's not really necessary, but I just felt that that looked a bit neater. I hope that helps.